welcome back everyone to another video. Uh, today we're at Green Bank. Um, this is just a place that Rob knew about and uh, you know I wanted to come and check it out for myself. Um, so we had a bit of a fun time today. Uh, nothing too crazy, just a bit of this and that, but um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. So we're just leaving the uh, main car park area now that um, this would have to be the most populated spot I've ever been to. You know, the amount of riders, the amount of 4x4s that were there. Even managed to uh, capture this guy on a buggy, which was pretty cool. So we're just travelling on the main path here. And um, the conditions were very wet, so there was a lot of uh, wet puddles and whatnot. And, you know, it, it was a very sandy sort of soil. Um, I hope I'm saying that the right way, but um, yeah, it is very slippery and whatnot underneath. But uh, I thought I'd show, a, you know, what it's like uh, going to this place. You know, uh, it's very fast and flowy. Uh, so if you do like to get up the speed and whatnot, uh, this is definitely a good place to do that. Um, myself, however, you know, I, I edge on the side of caution, especially when you're sort of sharing the uh, space with, you know, four-wheel drives and other bikes, because uh, obviously. Um, yeah, it's a two-way. We're just coming up to the lookout. Um, it sort of gives you a bit of an idea of how vast uh, this area is to go riding or go exploring, so to speak. Uh, we decided to uh, go down this little hill here and of course uh, GoPros don't do anything justice at all. Uh, these ruts that I've got on my left uh, easy would swallow a, um, you know, the front tyre or back tyre of a bike, no worries at all. Um, you know, it, it's definitely not anything sort of challenging but, you know, it, it's still a, a great learning curve on, uh, you know, improving your lines and that going up hills and whatnot. head back just to make sure that uh, Rob's partner uh, in her four-wheel drive is doing okay uh, and uh, this happens. So we've just been out uh, exploring uh, various different trails and whatnot. You know, had a little bit of a log jump coming up. I'm not 
kidding me, dude? <laughs> Holy shit! Was that because you were behind me? <laughs> oh no! You did a back wheel thing, you did it over there. And, oh, that was so good though. <laughs> oh, head, sorry, bro. Head to toe. <laughs> yeah, head to toe. Oh, I'm sorry, bro. I'm not thirsty now, I'm hydrated. Yeah, yeah. A little bit muddy, but that's a bit extra flavour. <laughs> Can't see out my goggles, I should have wore tear offs. <laughs> So I just found this little uh, side trail to go and explore. Uh, this is my first time sort of running down it, so to speak. But, um, you know, it wasn't too bad of a little track. You know, it definitely got a bit uh, muddy uh, towards the end of it. You know, but it, w it was a good run. It had its fair share of, uh, you know, rocks and whatnot as you go down. And it, uh, nothing too crazy. Good, good bit of fun, though. Um, you know, nice little fast-paced. Good to keep that nice flow going. Welcome back. It's uh, just me by myself at the moment. Rob's just having a bit of a, a bit of a break at the moment. He's uh, sort of going off his bike. Wants to have a little breather. Uh, so I thought I'd just go for a quick little ride, have a little explore. Take you guys a, a look at the ride. Thanks for watching everyone and hopefully I'll catch you all in the next one. Don't forget to leave your thoughts and comments down below.